want to ride my bicycle. I want to ride oh. my... Gee, Andy! Sorry, dude, we, we forgot the update. What have we said about interrupting bow time? Sorry, but with all the crap with you and Bender, we, we forgot to do the update. Bender. I'm, I'm supposed to be on camera this week. And according to who? Zoe. Zoe said I could be on camera this week. I keep this up, I'm gonna have your job. It'll be me doing the weekly updates. Bye, Brian. It's gonna be me! It's my time! So we need to get in the fan questions before we upload the video. Yeah, and we have to upload the video tonight. I got errands to do, dude. You're gonna have to follow me around while I take care of my crap. Okay. I'm really not happy about this. Zoe! There you are. Where have you been? I've been waiting for you for the last four days. I'm anyway, you here. have to go talk to Bo. He's being a huge jerk. Oh, yeah? Yes! Okay, so remember when you said that I could be on camera for that last update? Uh-huh. Yeah, well, he locked me out completely. He just wouldn't let me be on camera. Uh -huh. I told him that you said to, and then we got into this big fight. Anyway, it's all on YouTube, and I'm a complete laughing stock. So you've got to go talk to him. Everyone thinks that's hilarious. It's great! Everyone's laughing! Yay! That's okay, great. well, that's great. I, I, I'm, I'm glad that everyone's having a great time, but still, you promised I could be on camera. Zoe, look at me. Uh-huh. Am I laughing? No, you are not. Exactly. So please go in there and deal with Bo. All right. Toast. Okay. All right. And I will All watch. Right. It'll be no, great. I'm, no, I'm going to be I'm right gonna, there with you. Let's do this. Right Let's take right it to him. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Let's go. All right. <laughs> yes. What? I'm definitely on your side. I am 100% going to take care of right. it. Right. So just go over there and tell Absolutely. him. Absolutely. But we will wait. see you out there. I can't come? Nope. What? Bye. Thank you, Zoe. Try and work. Hey. All right. This is about Bender, isn't it? This is absolutely about Bender. Why do you do this to me? No, 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 no. You are here to do your job, and you should have trusted that what I said that he could do a little bit, just I'll be on camera for just a little bit, that that, that would be okay. But the least damage that he could do would be running the outro. Perfect. He could definitely do that. He can maybe do that. Positively, absolutely can do that. All right, well, we'll see. Okay. And if he screws the pooch? Well, that won't happen. And if it does, we can cover it up with dancing kittens. Zombies. Zombies yes. would be consistent zombies. with our branding. All right. I was going to go with thunderbolts, but zombies probably okay. makes more sense. Something blitzy, that's fine. Yeah. All right. Check. YouTube user Science Mile asks what exactly the difference is between Dead Gentleman Productions and Zombie Orpheus Entertainment. Official line. They are creative partners. Don't mention the pies or the grudge match. The simple answer is that Dead Gentleman handles production, that is, the creation of the entertainment, and Zoe handles distribution, which is getting the entertainment to you. You know, you hired me so that I can figure out which things shouldn't be mentioned in front of people, right? Ah, uh, and you'd think you would have put that together by now, but still, no. You know you're still wearing your workshop goggles, right? You are supposed to tell me about that earlier. Benda didn't tell you. <laughs> okay. So are we good here? I hate my life. More go round. Uh, we had a question from Agent Crystal Project about upcoming gamers films. Uh, we can tell you that one of the iron, many irons in the fire that Matt Mansell has is called The Game is Pwned. That'll be an online series. There's going to be another gamers movie which focuses on the character of Cass. And we had a script reading this week of the hell uh, of The Gamers, Humans and Household. So this is a script that I've written many, many years ago. Um, and then convert it into a three-part short. Ben decided to, we should, re, said we should really rebrand this as a gamers. Woo! Well, we can always make more episodes of this. Hey, guys! Hey! Uh, <coughs> Sorry, I'm late. Where the fuck is that? Ah, uh, no, working. Oh, uh, yeah. It's hard to find. It took Ladies, me Ladies, are you gluten intolerant? Because we've got rice. <laughs> 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 All right, so, again. A firelit room hewed from cold, uncaring stone. At a gargantuan table, a freakishly pale jester drums his fingers by a roll of scrolls. 
I wondered if you would show. You think we are not up to your challenge? I think you are alone. A swarthy rogue steps out of the shadows by the table. Then you are hardly paying attention. An armored warrior violently kicks a hole through the wall. You doubt our might? Our metal? A wizard in flowing robes materializes in a burst of flame. If so, then you are truly a fool. Hey guys, this week we're also offering a trivia contest. There's an exclusive forum on zombieorpheus.com where you can enter your answers. The first person to respond correctly gets a free DVD. The question is this, there are two performers in Journey Quest who have both speaking and non-speaking roles. The first is Dead Gentleman regular Kevin Inouye, who also play, who played the Orc Shaman and several other Orcish roles. The second is up to you to determine, so give us the correct answer and we'll ship you a DVD. Finally, here at the close of this update, I offer you the outro. With great personal trepidation, Brian Bender everybody. Greetings, and welcome to the Zombie Orpheus Weekly Entertainment Update. I'm your host, Brian Bender, and this week we're going to answer your uh, submitted questions and, um, what was the other thing? Outro, buddy. Uh, Outro. Uh, End. Out. Outro. You got it. Perfect. Links, like, um, the videos, and, uh, leave us your comments. Whatever. Stabbed you!